this is the time of year where I like to scare you guys um, by saying the number of days there are until the fashion show. 67 days. <gasps> <laughs> I that. that was a good reaction. We've been looking at all of this stuff for months. What sections go where, um, what models go where, and it's very far along. Today was the last group production meeting for everyone to get together, to see everything one last time before we really go off and put the final touches on the show. At this point, is it worth fast forwarding to show day? Can you go back to your image? Yeah. I mean, I, I personally, I, I, I love these pieces. I'd hate for these to be killed on the day because... We didn't think about it enough now. It. Is this better to be closer to it or farther from it? Um, it works both ways. Um, and I don't actually have a super strong opinion either way. You could put it either side. And you know, actually, OK, I'll make, I'll make a decision. Um, lamp posts this side, um, architectural right. stuff the other, the other side. side. Indecision is in, in what I do is a, is, is a bad thing. So you're either decisively right or decisively wrong, but indecision is just like everything just grinds to a halt and you end up with mediocrity, which is never great. President of Universal Records called me yesterday and he said, uh, he said, you know, I know you'd inquired about Selena and he said, we'd really like to try to make this happen. Um, tell me what you need and we'll send you whatever songs you want. We'll do it in any of this. And he said, we do research uh, with her fans, and the number one thing in the world that they want to see her on is your show. When we come to uh, a talent's manager with the combination of the Victoria's Secret show, which is, um, which is unlike anything else, and they don't get another venue like that all year long. There just isn't one. We feel so well planned, and everything is all you know buttoned up. We know the sections. We know the music artists that we want to go after. We know what things are looking like, but it's still now crunch time. OMG. What the? It's incredible, I right? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, I know. It's firework. Like, it's so it's certainly exciting. Yeah. So We're going to see money. Everyone has a lot of, you know, wonderful ideas for the show. And then it's really, you know, hurting it all together. And what's happening? Oh, oh, wow. Oh my God. I think it's the most intricate piece we have ever done. That's a happy moment. You never know, you know, when you sketch it and then design it and do the fittings, because that is custom made for her. You never know how it's going to come in. Honestly, that exceeds my expectation. That looked amazing. Working under the assumption we're starting the show with Boho Psychedelic. To disperse as many as we can, lighting elements of all kinds of different shapes and everything like that that are highly programmable. We're probably going to so be mixing cool. different types of sources. I'm nervous about this one. I can't quite get it into my head. The, the mix of, of the two techniques and the reveal of the first girl. It makes me nervous and I'm not sure that it sets the kind of the, the agenda of the show as we have in previous years. It was very important for me as one of the executive producers to really listen to Hamish and listen to what his feedback was because it has to work for him. Uh, it can't just be beautiful and um, be dramatic. It has to look good on television. I disagree with Hamish wholeheartedly about the aesthetic juxtaposition being strange. I'm entirely convinced it's actually going to look amazingly rich. You have to trust the people that you've hired. You have, you have to trust them to do um, thoughtful work <clears throat> and to have a vision. Just this coming in, super dim, backlit, smoke behind, content here, amazing. girls gets preset, thing just explodes in your face. It's totally rock and roll. I mean, it's rock and roll. It's just like, ah. Anything that can get the audience screaming and excited um, to us is a very exciting opening. So we've done the first five seconds. One of the most exciting things about working on the show is the, all the different artisans that we work with. Wow. So, I'm a bit confused. This is not good. We cannot hold back because 
it would be at the expense of the show.